Bananas in pyjamas are coming down the stairs. Bananas in pyjamas are coming down in pairs. Bananas in pyjamas are chasing teddy bears. Cause on Tuesdays they will try to catch them on the way. Good morning, Amy. Hello, Bananas. What are you doing? Uh, we're doing a big house clean, inside and out. A big house clean needs big help. Thanks. I've nearly finished the windows, but you could help Lulu and Morgan inside. Then it's big help for Lulu and Morgan. <laughs> I'll get them. I just have to... <laughs> Oh dear. Sorry, Amy. We hope your clothes will clean up okay. Oh, don't worry, Bananas. Who cares about a bit of dirt? Right. Thanks, Amy. No trouble, Bananas. Only one more window to clean. Honestly, she's just so dirty and scruffy. Huh? She always looks really ugly. Horrible. But can't you talk to Amy about this? She never listens. So her clothes always stay wrinkled and dusty. It's embarrassing having to live in the same house as her. <gasps> They're talking about me. She's very grimy. And grubby. Yuck. Grimy? Grubby? Me? So what will you do? We should tell Amy that if she doesn't have a good wash, then she has to stay outside. And that she can't ever come back inside till she's clean and nice. I'm just as clean as they are. How can they say such a thing? I've got a better idea. Why don't we just wash her ourselves? But won't Amy get upset if someone else touches her old dolly? Not if we take proper care of her. And it'll give Amy a big surprise when she finds out. pajama rific <laughs> They think I'm too grubby to stay inside. All right, then. I won't stay inside. I won't stay here at all. Goodbye. So pop and dunk. This dolly's going to be like new. Amy's going to be so happy. <laughs> oh no, my dolly. Oh, don't worry, dolly. I'll sneak back soon and get you. At night, when the others are sleeping. Be brave. <laughs> She should be dry in no time. We can't wait to surprise Amy. Why wait? Let's show her now. Banana-tastic. Amy! Amy! Amy? Where could she be? The beach? The beach is too cold today. The lake? The lake is too far. The park? The park is just right. To the park! I'll go to Cousin Dinky. He won't say I'm grubby and awful. <laughs> uh, oh. <laughs> Amy? You are here. Uh, oh, looks like you need some help. Thanks, Bananas. <gasps> bananas? What are you doing with all these clothes? It looks like you're running away. <laughs> I am. Why? I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> Goodbye. What do we do, B2? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. It's run away with Amy time. <laughs> Wait, Amy. Wait for us. Oh, I don't want you to stop me. We don't want to stop you. We want to come with you. You what? If you're running away, we'll run away too. 
You don't have to do that, Bananas. But you'll be all by yourself. You'll need friends. You can't run away alone. But... We'll go home and pack some things. Then we'll be straight back to run away with you. But, <laughs> Bananas! Uh, oh, dear. Bananas! Amy! The Bananas were going to tell Amy about her dolly. If we find the Bananas, we'll find Amy. If I'm quick enough, the Bananas won't catch up. Here we are, Amy. Please, Bananas. I don't need anyone to run away with me. We want to run away with you. Uh, run away? Hello, Hello Bernard. Bernard. Who's running away? We are Topsy. And Amy, too. Oh, is this a game? Uh, I don't think so. But if you run away, who will I play with? Hmm, I know. Why don't you come too? What? Oh, good idea, Bananas. I'll do it! pajama -rific. But, Topsy, uh, Bananas, I... What about you, Bernard? Would you like to run away too? Run away? I don't want to run away. I think it's a silly idea. Bernard's right. You should all listen to him. Hmm, but um, someone has to look after you young ones. If you are running away, then uh, I suppose I'll have to join you. Yay! Uh, now, we need some food and supplies, of course. I suggest a trip to Rat Shop is in order. Lead on, Bernard. Oh, I don't believe this. This is impossible. You're what? We're running away and we need supplies. But if you all run away, who will come to my shop? I won't have any customers. I'll be all alone! You don't have to be alone, Rat, because you could join us. The more of us who run away, the more we can help each other. It's going to be fun! Oh, well then, if everyone else is running away... All right, I'm running away too! Yay! <laughs> oh, no. Amy! Bananas! <gasps> Look! There's one of Amy's jumpers. What's it doing up there? Hmm, the more I think about this, the more I think it could be quite an adventure. Let's all have an adventure! Yay! <sighs> oh, it's closed. Shop closed because we're running away. Running away? Who's running away? There must be somebody around. Somebody who can tell us what's going on. Hello? 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 Anybody? 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 Adventures, adventures, we're off to have adventures. Adventures of the nerds. Stop! Everybody, stop! We can't do this. We can't all run away. Why can't we? We're all friends, aren't we? And friends always stick together. But but we aren't all together. Where's Morgan and Lulu? And Charlie's not here either. Then I suggest we better go and collect them. Lead on, Bernard. Adventures, adventures, we're off to have adventures. At last. Now I can run away properly. We were looking for you. And we were looking for you. Are you running away? We are. You have to come and join us, Teddies. Why are you running away? Well, I'm running away because Bernard and Topsy are running away. And we're running away because the bananas are running away. And we're running away because... Uh, why are we running away again, B2? Uh, because Amy's running away. Amy? Amy? Where could she be? She must be running away on her own. Amy, come back! You can't run away without your friends. But why is Amy running away? It's very nice of everyone to run away with me, but I have to do this by myself, even though I do miss my dolly and Lulu and Morgan. <laughs> Accident. 
What's going on, Amy? Why are you running away? I was running away because you said I was grumpy. Huh? huh? And that I wasn't allowed back inside unless I was clean and nice. Oh, Amy. You are silly sometimes. Me? Silly? Come with us. We have something to show you. We were talking about her. <gasps> My old dolly. We gave her a wash. We wanted it to be a surprise for you. We weren't talking about you at all. Oh, I thought, but you were, oh, I really have been silly, haven't I? No, no, don't worry, Amy. We're all silly sometimes. Very true, Topsy. All except me, of course. The main thing is, we're all back together again. Just as friends should be. You won't be needing that now, Amy. We'll take it back inside. Be careful, bananas. Oh. Here's some water for you, little flower. And some for you, big flower. Oh, wait a minute, B1. I already watered that big flower. We've got so many flowers, we can't tell which is which. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. It's, it's give away some flowers time. <laughs> Let's put it here, B1. That's the perfect spot, B2. Cheese and whiskers, what are you doing down there, bananas? We brought you a gift. Look. Oh, what a lovely flower. It really brightens up my shop. And you just need to water it once a day. I'll do that right now, bananas. <laughs> Bye. Oh, my goodness, Rat. That's a magnificent plant. It is rather nice, isn't it, Bernard? I just wish I had some of your gardening talent. <laughs> oh, no, Bernard. It's a gift. I know, Rat. Uh, a talent like that is a gift. Uh, <laughs> no, what I meant was... Rat, could you give me some advice on how to brighten up my garden? But, Bernard, I... Well, why don't you uh, come around for honey cakes and we can talk about it then? Honey cakes? Uh, well, I suppose I could give you a few ideas. Uh, another honey cake, Rat? <laughs> well, if you insist. Uh, now, um, what do you think my garden needs, Rat? Oh, uh, yes, 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 yes. let me think. Ah, I've got it, Bernard. A fountain. A fountain? Uh, are you sure, Rat? Oh, 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 yes. It'll look like a picture. Something like this. Hmm. Well, uh... Who will I get to build this fountain? Uh, would you do it? <laughs> oh, no, Bernard. I wouldn't know the first thing about it. Uh, of course, I'd pay you lots of honey cakes. Really? Uh, oh, in that case, I'm your rat. See you tomorrow, rat. I'll start on the fountain first thing, Bernard. Oh, did you say fountain, rat? Oh, that's right, Lulu. I'm building a fountain in Bernard's garden. Oh, I didn't realize you were good with gardens, Rat. Well, our garden could do with your help then, Rat. And mine too. I'm not sure if I can do everybody's. Of course, we'd give you honey cakes in return. On second thoughts, a Rat's garden makeovers would be happy to help. So you'll uh, finish the fountain today, Rat? I'll have it up in no time. Oh, excellent. Ooh. Well, this cement is so heavy. Hmm. Perhaps I'll dig the hole first. Oh, dear. 
Well, this garden makeover business is harder than I thought. Hello, Rat. What are you doing in Bernard's backyard? Oh, building a fountain, Bananas. That sounds like fun. Oh, no, Bananas. It's... Oh, oh yes, Bananas. It's so much fun. You really should try it. We we'd love to. Please be my guests. I just need a hole there, Bananas. No problem, Rat. Oh, my. Oh, I can tell by the way you handle those shovels that you've got talent for garden work, Bananas. Do you think so, Rat? Oof! Oh, most definitely. And you know, I'm also building a fish pond for Topsy and a pergola for the teddies. That's quite a lot, Rat. Oof! Yes, I only wish I could find someone to do all the work. I, I mean, someone to share all the fun with. Why don't we help you, Rat? Oh, what a wonderful idea, Bananas. Now, I just have to uh, uh, go somewhere. So I'll give you all the plans and um, I'll be back uh, very soon. Bye. Hello, Bananas. Have you seen Rat anywhere? You just missed him, Lulu. But we're working with him now, so maybe we can help. Well, it's just that Rat said he'd finish our pergola today and he hasn't even started yet. Don't worry, Lulu. We've got the plans, so we can start building it. Oh, thank you, Bananas. I'll hold the post and you hammer. Good thinking, B1. Oh, hello, Bananas. Have you seen Rat anywhere? Not for a while, Topsy. But we're working with him, so maybe we can help. It's just that he promised to finish my fish pond by lunchtime. Lunchtime? Yes, and he hasn't even started. Don't worry, Topsy. We'll get that fish pond built for you. Ah, oh, thank you so much, Bananas. <laughs> Let's move the cement closer to where the pond's going. Good thinking, B2. <laughs> Oopsie. Oh, uh, hello, Bananas. Uh, have you seen Rat anywhere? He said he'd be back soon. Maybe we can help. Uh, well, Bananas, it's just that there's no work happening at my place. Nor mine. I thought you were going to help me, Bananas. Um... Rat did promise to finish my fountain. And our pergola. Uh, don't worry, Bernard and Lulu. We'll be at your places very soon. Oh, oh thank, thank you, you bananas. bananas. We'll have to work very fast, B1. Very, very fast, B2. Come on. <laughs> We're the building bananas. We hammer and saw. We measure and make. It takes. Well, we finished everything, B1. So let's go home and have a rest. Oh my goodness! I wanted a fish pond, not a pergola in a hole. Oh, that rat in a hat! Here's your honey cakes, rat. <gasps> I wanted a pergola, not a fountain on stilts. What's this doing here? I wanted a fountain, not a giant fish pond. Where's that rat in the hat? Rat! Wake up! Oh. <laughs> what a pleasant surprise. We want to know what you've done to our gardens, Rat. Your gardens? What did I do to them? Well, instead of a fish pond, I've got a pergola in a hole. And instead of a pergola, I've got a fountain on stilts. And instead of a fountain, I've got a fish pond big enough to swim in. Oh, dear. The bananas must have done it. You can't blame the bananas. You were in charge, Rat, and you left them to do everything on their own. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, would a honey cake help? No, Rat, but you could put my garden back the way it was. And mine as well. Mine too, Rat. But that's going to take a lot of work. We are sure you'll manage. Bye, Bye Rat. Rat! Oh, this 
is impossible. Hello, rat. Oh, hello, bananas. I, I'm very sorry I left you to do all that work. Yes, rat. That was a bit naughty, but we just came to see if you wanted a hand fixing everything up. You did? We'll only help you if you promise to work too, Rat. I'll work just as hard as you. <laughs> look, look! There's only one problem. What's that, Bananas? If we take out the fish pond, the fountain and the pergola, what are we going to do with them? Ooh, I don't know, Bananas. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. We, we could, could build, build a new garden. A new garden? But where? That's everything fixed, Lulu. Oh, thank you, Bananas. But what did you do with the fountain? Ah, well, if you join us in the park for afternoon tea, you'll find out. Ta-da! There's the fountain, the pergola, and the fish pond. Oh, so that's where everything went. Yes! And all built by uh, the bananas. With a little help from rats. What is it you want? Uh, we wanted to talk to Rat. Has he gone away somewhere? Gone? But don't you know who I am? Do you know B1? I don't know B2. They don't recognise me. I could have some fun with this. <coughs> oh, uh, yes. I'm afraid Rat's gone away on, uh, on a holiday. A holiday? Uh, that's right. And he left me in charge of the shop. I'm his aunt. But I, I, I mean, uncle. Oh, Rat's uncle. You even look a bit like Rat. Do I? No, no not, not really. really. Is that a crown? You're not a, a king, are you? Oh, <laughs> heavens no. I'm just a prince. A, a prince? prince? Yes, I'm a, a prince rat from Rat Lavachia. A real prince! Pajama Rama! Oh, calm down, calm down! But we've never had a prince here before! We have to tell the teddies, B2! Come on! Wait, bananas! I was only having a joke! Hi, bananas! Teddies, there's a prince in Cuddles Avenue! He's Rat's uncle, Prince Rat from Ratlovakia! <gasps> Are you sure, Bananas? Yes, he's got a robe and a crown and everything. Let's go and see him. Yes, let's! Cheese and whiskers? What's the big hurry? Oh, it's only you, Rat. Back from holidays already. Holidays? Oh, oh, oh there! Uh, now, let me explain. Has Prince Rat gone away? Well, yes, in a manner of speaking, but... Oh, no! We were going to invite him to a special welcome lunch. With lots of yummy food. A special lunch? B2, 
But if he's already gone, we'll have to cancel it. Oh, no! Don't do that! Uh, Prince Rat is... Uh, at the back! Oh, the prince is still here! Can we meet him then? Of course! I'll uh, just go and wake him. Don't move! Uh, wake up, Uncle Prince! Uh, you've got visitors! There! Uh, sorry, I uh, can't get through the day without my princely snooze. Pleased to meet you, Prince Rat. Please, just think of me as an ordinary rat. Your princeness, we want to invite you to a special lunch. To welcome you to Cuddlestown. Oh, oh how kind. And of course, Rat's invited too. Uh, Rat? You know, your nephew. Oh, that rat. But he's uh, already gone back on holiday. See, there he goes now. Can you see him, B1? Not really, B2. Look, he's waving. Oh, wave, everyone. Bye, rat. Bye. 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 See you later, rat. rat. What a pity he can't come. But you'll be there, won't you, Prince? I wouldn't miss it for anything. Great. We'll start preparing now. So he's from Ratlovakia, you say? Where is that exactly? Uh, do you know B1? Who cares where he's from? He's a handsome prince. That's him, B1. After you, B2. No, after you, B1. All, All right, right, then. then. Oh! Welcome to our humble home, Prince Rat. No need to bow that low, Bananas. Prince, we'd like you to meet Bernard, Charlie and Topsy. Pleased to meet you, you Prince, Prince Rat. Rat. Charmed, I'm sure. Please sit down, your ratness. Ah, lunch! <laughs> Something wrong, Prince? Oh, this chair is a little hard on my royal bottom. <gasps> Quick, get the Prince a cushion! A cushion, B1? Cushion coming up, B2. Here you are, Prince. <sighs> Much better. Oh, and this food looks delicious. Have some cheesecake, Mr. Prince. Only one. Let's see. Munchy honey cakes, yellow jelly, chocolate cake. Oh, yum. Mm. <laughs> Does the Prince seem a bit greedy, B1? Perhaps princes just get hungrier than normal people, me too. Oh, yeah. I may have eaten a tad too much. He's asleep, B1. On the table, B2. That can't be very comfortable. Quick, get the prince another cushion. Another cushion, B1. Here it is, B2. I'll lift his princely head and you slide it under, B1. <gasps> oh, I've ripped the prince's whiskers off, B1. Oh, dear. Just a minute. He's not a prince. He's just rat, all dressed up. Look! You're right. He's no prince from Ratlovakia. Oh, oh that rat, rat in a hat. hat! He tricked us again. Pity we can't trick him back. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's Trick Rat Back Time! Is everything ready? All ready, Bananas! Then let's wake up Rat, B2. OK, his whiskers are back on. Now... Wakey, wakey, Prince Rat! <laughs> What's happening? Sorry, Prince, but we've got something very special planned in the garden. Dear Prince Rat, please join us in the Cuddles Avenue welcoming ceremony! What's that? You're about to find out, your rattiness. First put on this special hat for the guest of honour. Uh, what's the bowl for? To catch the mud pies we throw. I have to catch... Mud pies in my hat. 
Yes, while you're dancing. It's traditional. Cheese and whiskers. Is the sand ready? Sand's ready, bananas! What's the sand for? To sprinkle over you during the dance. Stop the music, Morgan. Dance, Prince. Dance! Hip, hip, hooray. Let's give three cheers. Close off your ears to the sighs and tears. Come on and laugh. Be hail and hearty. Join our happy village party. Prince Rat? I have to get back to my shop. Uh, I mean, my nephew's shop. Well, you can't leave now. You'll miss the best part. You mean there's more? Now we cover you in old feathers. And give you a bath in pond slime. Feathers? Pond slime? Can you stay? I'm terribly sorry, but the truth is, I don't need a welcoming ceremony. Why not? Because... I'm not really a prince. I'm just ordinary old rat in a hat. See? We knew that already. You knew. So this whole ceremony... Was a big joke. To pay you back for tricking us. <laughs> and you look so funny. <laughs> <laughs> I know I shouldn't have tricked you, but it was such fun being a prince for a day. You should all try it. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's, it's Prince, Prince for a Daytime! Why don't you come over to my place and I'll treat you exactly like kings and queens. Here you go, Mom. Thank you, Rat. How do I look? Oh, magnificent, Princess Amy. Look, Rat, we're the Prince Banana 1 and Prince Banana 2. And I'm Princess Topsy. Now we should have a special prince and princess's welcome lunch. But where would we find one? At our place. I mean, our castle, of course. You mean there's still enough food left? Heaps. Let's go, everyone. <laughs> Everything's turned out well after all. Wait for me! <laughs> And three, and four, I win. No, not again. Congratulations, Morgan. <sighs> it's time for bed, everyone. But I'm not tired yet. <sighs> then why are you yawning? I'm not yawning. Not much, anyway. Okay, toys, time for bed. That's funny. Where's Kevin? Kevin! Where are you? What's wrong? It's Kevin, my fluffy buddy. He should be on the pillow with my other toys, but he's gone. Oh, don't worry, Morgan. He'll be around somewhere. He's not. And I can't go to sleep without him. Let's look. He's not on the sofa. He's not under the sofa. Oh, he's lost. We're never going to find him. I'm sure we'll find your bunny tomorrow. Tomorrow? But I can't go to sleep without Kevin. What a quiet night, B1. Quiet and peaceful, B2. I want my fluffy bunny. Did you hear that, B1? Someone sounds upset at the Teddy's house. Hello, Amy. Bananas, what brings you here so late? Uh, we heard a noise. Is everything all right? No, Kevin is missing. Poor Kevin, that's terrible. Uh, who is Kevin? A pink fluffy bunny. And I can't go to sleep without him. This is even more serious than we thought, B2. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. 
It's Detective Bananas time! Wait here, Teddies. Where are you going? To change into our special detective clothes. The Detective Bananas are on the case, Morgan. Just lead us to the scene of the crime. Kevin should be on my pillow, but he's not. Hmm. What do you think, Detective B2? Hmm. I think he's definitely not on the pillow, Detective B1. So where is he? Don't worry, Morgan. We'll find Kevin for you. The Detective Bananas always get their bunny. Now, do you have a photo of the missing bunny? I think so. Here he is. Hmm, that's very odd, Detective B1. Kevin looks exactly like Morgan. That is Morgan, Detective B2. Kevin is the one with the floppy ears. Oh, silly me. So, does Kevin have any other friends? Well, he is friendly with Bruce. Ah, ah Bruce. Bruce. Can we talk to Bruce? If you want to. Here he is. Hello, Bruce. When did you last see Kevin? Hmm? He won't talk, Detective B1. Of course he won't talk, Bananas. He's a toy. <laughs> so he is. <laughs> bananas, we really don't think Kevin is in the house. Why not? Because Morgan was carrying Kevin around all day. So he could have left him anywhere in Cuddlestown. Aha! Then we know exactly how to find him. How? All we have to do is go everywhere that Morgan went. And we're sure to find the missing bunny. The Detective Bananas are on the case. Rat, are you awake? I was just going to sleep. Sorry, Rat, but we're on an urgent case. Kevin is missing. That's terrible. Uh, who is Kevin? Morgan's fluffy bunny. His bunny? Morgan left him here this morning. And I can't get to sleep without him. We have to search the whole shop from top to bottom. Bananas, be careful with... Never mind. Sorry, Rat. Detective work can be messy. Uh, very messy, Detective B1. I don't think Kevin is here, Bananas. Neither do I. They could be right, Detective B1. But if he's not here, where is he? Where did you go next, Morgan? We went to Charlie's place. That's it. I'm sure I left Kevin at Charlie's place. Charlie's place it is, Detective B1. Oh, wait, Bananas. What about this mess? Oh, uh, sorry, Rat. Grab that broom, Detective B1. No problem, Detective B2. It's clean-up time. Oops. All right, I agree. Your detective work is far too important to waste time here. We're happy to stay and help. No, 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 no. Off you go. I insist. Thanks, Rat. Bye. 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 Oh, jeez. So you think Morgan left a bunny here? A fluffy bunny called Kevin. And I can't go to sleep without him. I don't remember seeing him, but if you want to take a look... Thanks, Charlie. Can you see Kevin anywhere, Detective B2? No, Detective B1. Why don't we dust for paw prints? Good idea, Detective B2. What are you doing, Bananas? Looking for Kevin's paw prints. With our special paw print finding dust. Hmm, but how does it work? Simple, Charlie. We just put some dust on our brush, like so. Then brush it over everything to see if Kevin's paw prints are anywhere. So we'll know if he's been here. Watch! <laughs> <coughs> Can you see any paw prints, Detective B1? 
I can't see anything at all, Detective B2. <coughs> <coughs> Any sign of Kevin Bananas? No, Morgan. Any sign of him over here, Teddy's? No bananas. Oh, dear. So where did you go next, Morgan? Um, we just went home. <sighs> Poor Kevin. Where can he be? Don't worry, Morgan. We're sure to find him tomorrow. But what about tonight? How will I get to sleep without him? That's a problem, Detective B1. A big problem, Detective B2. Hmm. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, Detective B1? I think I am, Detective B2. It's bunny making time! Bunny making? We'll make you a new bunny to take to bed. A new bunny? But... That's brilliant, Bananas. I'll get some material. And I'll get the sewing kit. And we'll get some stuffing. And I'll... I'll go to my room. That's funny. Kevin! You were here all along. You naughty bunny. Wait till I tell the others. How's the bunny's head going, Teddies? Nearly finished. How's the bunny's body going, Bananas? Almost done. Bananas, look what I found. Sorry, Morgan. Can't look now. We're busy sewing the bunny's tail on. Lulu, Amy, look! Sorry, Morgan. Can't look now. We're busy making the new bunny's ears. Oh, well. Come on, Kevin. There. All done. He's perfect, Detective B1. And so cute and cuddly, Detective B2. What do you think, Morgan? Where is Morgan? I think he went to his room. Ta-da! Meet your new bunny, Morgan. Morgan? He's asleep. And look what he's cuddling. It's, it's Kevin, Kevin the Fluffy Bunny. He must have been in Morgan's bed all along. Well, Detective B1, that's another case solved. Thanks for your help, Bananas. Yes, thank you. No problem, Teddies. Actually... There is one problem, Detective B2. What's that, Detective B1? Morgan won't need this bunny now. So what will we do with it? I think I might have an idea, Detective B1. <sighs> good night, B1. Good night, B2. And, and good, good night, night, little bunny. bunny. Sweet dreams. <laughs> We've got our bat, B1. And we've got our ball, B2. Now it's time to go out and play. But who are we going to play with? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's playing with the teddies time. Morning, Amy. Hello, Bananas. What are you doing? Uh, uh, I'm trying to put our new bird feeder up into the tree. But uh, I just can't reach. We'll help. Thanks, Bananas. Here you are, Amy. Here's the bird seed for the bird feeder. <sighs> Amy, you put it up too high. We'll lift you up. <whistles> Thanks, Bananas. Our pleasure, Morgan. <sighs> I wish I was a lot taller. How tall? Tall like the Bananas. 
Why is that, Morgan? If I was a tall teddy, I could do so much more than I can do now. There are lots of good things about being small. You can walk under branches. And low-flying ducks. And you can help us play with our new bat and ball. You're right. Let's go, Amy. Sorry, Morgan. I've still got gardening to do. Oh. Well, then let's ask Lulu. Come on, bananas. On our way, Morgan. Sometimes being tall isn't so good, B1. Not good at all, B2. Sorry, Bananas. I can't come and play until I finish making these muffins. Yum! Can someone please get the Sultanas? They're on the top shelf in the pantry. Sultanas coming up. Wait, I'll get the stepladder. No need, Morgan. I'll get it. Thanks, B1. I'm not even tall enough to get things out of the cupboard. Don't worry about it. Come on, Morgan. Let's go and play. OK, then. Good morning, Cannon Bear. Hello, Bananas. Morgan. We're going to play in the park. Would you like to come too? Thank you, Bananas, but I'm off to do some bird watching with my new binoculars. See? Oh, look at that delicious apple. I'll get it for you, Cannon Bear. Oh, no, not tall enough again. Never mind, Morgan. I'll just get it myself. Toodaloo. Everyone's taller than me. Hi, Bananas. What are you doing? We're off to the park to play. Would you like to join us? We could play Morgan in the middle. Wow. How do you play that? Well, I'll throw the ball. And I'll hit the ball. And you see if you can catch it. Ready? Go! Ugh. Oh, come on, Morgan! I'm trying! <laughs> You're making it go too high! <laughs> You'll just have to grow taller, Morgan! Ah, it's a silly game anyway, I don't want to play. Morgan, where are you going? Oh, dear. Morgan! Come back! We'll go and see what's wrong. What's the matter, Morgan? I don't want to be small anymore. I want to be tall like you. You're a teddy. And teddies are never tall. That's why they're so special. I want to be tall. I don't want to be tall now. Where are you going this time? To see Charlie. Maybe he can help. I've been asked to invent lots of things before, but never a way to make someone taller. You have to help me. I want to be tall, not small. From small to tall. Now that's a tricky one. We could wait for you to grow. No, that's too slow. I want to be tall now. Now? That's even trickier. I know. Maybe you could stretch me. You mean a stretching machine? Do you think you can do it? Hmm. Well... Please, Charlie, please. <laughs> well, what do you think? It's amazing, I think. How does it work? I strap you in and turn the handle and you'll be tall in no time. Hop aboard. Uh, maybe we should give it a test run first. A good thinking, Morgan. <laughs> this old rubber tire tube will be just the thing. <laughs> Now watch. I'll wind the handle just like this. <laughs> wow! Look at how it stretches. If that was me, I'd be really tall by now. I think that's stretched it enough. No, let's stretch it just a little bit more. If I'm going to be tall, I want to be really tall. <laughs> Perhaps just one more turn. There. Now, one more for luck. <laughs> I'm not sure that last turn was a good idea, Morgan. What's happening? What should we do? Move! <laughs> oh, oh. oh, sorry, Charlie. Not to worry, Morgan. But I think we should forget the idea of a stretching machine. Yeah. Come on. We'd better find that old tube. What a marvellous day for a stroll. 
at what simply delicious looking apples. Eeny, meeny, miny, moe. Cheese and whiskers. Oh, it's raining apples. <laughs> Rat, are you all right? Oh, fine, dear boy. Nothing that a nice crisp apple won't fix. Well, Morgan, it looks like we've invented a new way to pick apples. If a stretching machine can't make me taller, Charlie, then what can? I don't know. Hello, Charlie. Hello, Morgan. Hi, Bananas. How can I help you, Bananas? We'd like to borrow your ladder, please. We want to clean our upstairs windows. Help yourselves, Bananas. Thanks, Charlie. I wish there was a way I could be as tall as a ladder. Hmm. Now that gives me an idea. We've got our soapy water. And our cleaning sponges. Everything we need to make our windows sparkly clean. Hi, Bananas. Do you need a hand? Morgan. How's the weather down there? Look at you. You're so tall. tall. They're my new stilts. Charlie made them for me. Now I'll never have to be small again. Can I help wash your windows? Thanks, Morgan. Here's the bucket. And here's the ladder. <laughs> you don't need a ladder when you're as tall as me. Huh? Huh? Whoa. Look out, V1! He's going to fall, V2! Don't worry! We'll catch you! <laughs> Morgan! I'm okay, but my stilts don't work either. It doesn't matter what I do, I'll never be tall. Help! Help! Kevin Bear? What's wrong? No time to explain. Hooray! <laughs> Wait for me! A baby bird fell out of its nest and down between those rocks. Now it can't get out. <laughs> oh no! We're too big to fit. What can we do? We'll have to shift these rocks. How? Uh, with a tractor. Right! But we don't have a tractor. Ah! Uh, we'll have to find someone who can fit between the rocks. I can! I can easily get down there. Don't worry, I'll get you, baby. Be careful, Morgan! Everything's fine. Here we are. My pleasure, Mother Bird. Great work, Morgan. I think this calls for a celebration. Here's to Morgan, the hero of the day. Hooray for Morgan! Thanks, everyone. But you know one thing, Morgan? You couldn't have saved that bird if you were tall. Maybe being small's not so bad after all. Maybe, but I wish I could at least be tall enough to play Morgan in the middle. Maybe you can. How? A bat for Pedro and a ball for Topsy. But V1... Morgan's too small to catch the ball. Not anymore, he's not. Hi, Topsy. Hi, Pedro. Ready to play whenever you are. Let's go, everyone. It's Morgan in the middle time. OK, Topsy, throw whenever you like. <coughs> Got it. Great work, partner. Right, Pedro. Let's see you hit it over me now. <coughs> Got it again. Who needs to be tall when you have friends like the bananas? Careful, Morgan. Ah, ah. Keep steady, Morgan. Ah, I can't hold on. I'll save you. Ah. Uh, is everyone okay? Somebody say something. <laughs> We might be tall, and I might be small, but, but we, we all, all have pajamatastic fun! <laughs> Another flag, please, bananas. Another flag it is. Coming up, Charlie. This is such a great idea for We Love Cuddles Town Day. Having everyone decorate their homes. It's pajama rific. <laughs> I'm glad you like it, bananas. 
Oh, hello, Birdie. Do you like Charlie's flags too? What sort of decorating will be on your home, Bananas? We haven't decided yet. We wanted to help you first. You've helped me lots, Bananas. You should start working on your own house now. Will, will do, do, Charlie. Bye, Bananas. Look at that. Bring back that flag, Bird. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh well. I guess one less flag won't make that much of a difference. <laughs> Hi, Bananas! Hello, Topsy! <laughs> Bye, Topsy! Hey, what's the big rush? We're going home! <laughs> so we can decorate it for the We Love Cuddles Town Day! Hey, don't forget you also promised to help me with my house! <laughs> we did? <sighs> we did! Of course we'll help you right away! Ah, thanks, Bananas! <laughs> This sparkly tinsel is banana-tastic. And it makes your home look banana-tastic too, Topsy. Hmm, we just need a little more and we'll be finished. It's you again. What did you do with Charlie's flag? <gasps> now you're taking some tinsel. Come back here with that. <laughs> Oh, I guess one less bit of tinsel won't matter. <laughs> bananas! Hi, Bernard! Bananas, you're going the wrong way. We are, Bernard? You said you'd help me decorate my house, which is this way. Oh, I do love balloons. So do we. Keep those balloons coming, Bananas. No problem, Bernard. Do you see who I see? I do see who you see. What do you think she wants now? She's taking a balloon. Give that back. Oh, well, I guess one less balloon won't make that much of a difference. <laughs> We've really got to hurry now. Oh, we'll never get to decorate our house. We've helped all our friends. Everyone but Rat and the Teddies. Did we promise to help Rat and the Teddies too? We did promise to help Rat and the Teddies. Oh. Thank you, Bananas. What would I do without you? Well, these paper lanterns you've helped me put up are perfect. They are very pretty. We like them a lot. What makes them extra special is the super big light in each lantern. Do you want to see them turned on? Yes, please, Rat. <laughs> Let there be a light! You can see my shop from outer space. <laughs> I'm a rat, I'm a rat, I'm a clever, clever rat. <laughs> Not you again. Now what are you after? <gasps> hey, that bird is taking my lantern. Stop! <laughs> Look out, bananas! <laughs> oh, cheese and Whiskers. You say the bird keeps taking things, Bananas. Well, she's taken a flag and some tinsel. And a balloon and a paper lantern. Has the bird taken any of your decorations? Uh, we haven't been able to decorate our home yet. We've been too busy helping our friends. You've helped us enough, Bananas. Just like always. You should go and decorate your place now. Thanks, Teddies. Bye, Bananas! Bananas? Is that the bird? That's the bird! <gasps> now she's taking fairy lights! Stop, bird! Stop! <laughs> oh, watch where you're going, Bananas! Bananas! Now 
we can decorate our home, B2. We're going to decorate with something that no one else has used. Flowers! <gasps> our flowers! They're gone! Someone's picked them! Who would do that? <gasps> you! You're not getting away this time! Bring back our flowers! <laughs> Where did she go? We've lost her! We have to think, B1. Thinking it is, B2. But how do you follow a bird when you can't fly like a bird? We can't think, B2. Not with that bird tweeting. Tweeting? tweeting? The bird! <laughs> She must be up there. What's that? I don't know, but it's coming down. Oh, oh no. no. It's a baby bird. He's fallen from his nest. Are you all right? Where's your mother, little bird? It's you. We'll talk later about those things you took. But first we'll put your baby back in the nest. All the way up there. Oh. I wonder how the bananas are decorating their home. I can't wait to see what they've done. They've done nothing. I think the bananas are going to need some help. Well, they did help us. So it's only fair that we should help them. I'll take the baby bird now, B1. Baby bird to you, B2. The nest can't be too far away. We're almost at the top. We did it. We're at the top. It's all the decorations. So that's why you took them. You wanted to decorate your nest. Like everyone in Cuddlestown is doing with their houses. <coughs> now that we know that, you can keep it all. It's okay, Mrs. Bird. We haven't forgotten. Now you stay with your mother. And don't try and fly again. Not until you're strong enough. Just look at this view, B2. Ah, it's fantastic. You can see all of Cuddlestown from up here. And look, you can see all our friends too. This has to be the best view ever. Except for one thing, B2. What's that, B1? Our house will be the only one with no decorations. Then we'd better do something, and fast. <laughs> oh. What's happened to our home? Where did all these decorations come from? Surprise! We saw that you hadn't decorated your house, so we decided to help. Since you helped decorate our homes, we thought we should do the same for you. You uh, do like it, don't you, Bananas? Did we do the right thing? It's Banana-tastic! <laughs> and now we've got a surprise for you. But we need your help, Bernard. Of course, Bananas. You can have anything you need. Then follow us, everyone. <laughs> Get ready, everyone. For the best sight you'll ever see. Wow! It's brilliant! You can see all our decorations. I must say the balloons around my house do look very pretty. I like my flags too. And I just love my lanterns. You see, this way we get to see all our decorations and all of Cuddlestown. What do you think, Birdie? <coughs> she likes it. And we couldn't agree more. Uh, couldn't agree more with what? We love Cuddlestown. <laughs>